How you going guys? Dan from Stewart's Racing. This will be night two. I just recapped from night one. Um, standing in the same spot, so we'll start off here. If you haven't seen night one, it's the one before this, so hit it up. Track pips well underway. Great is getting there. So if you haven't, I'm not gonna say the same thing as I just said to recap in the last one, but yeah, we're just down the bottom here. We're gonna um, tighten up the rear of the car to try and get it to balance, be a bit better balanced. Uh, I believe that what I've done to soften the rear shocks off, what I, in doing that, what I believe it's done, it's, a, it's allowed it to pick up the right hand rear wheel too much, which is just way too much wheel spin, wheel spin for days. So we're jacked up down there, I'll do that. No cleaning needed. Track, there was, I didn't even pull a tear off last night. That's how good it was. Smooth. Um, yeah, so. A lot, a lot of yelling down in the pits at the moment for some reason. Yeah, it's us. The Swan Hill, it's a full blown motorbike track. There's a massive go kart track up the front. Big facility here, it really is. Kids, Shane's back. If I don't, if I don't recap through the night, which I might not, I've got a friend up at the top filming. So I don't have my phone, she's got a phone, phone up here filming, so yeah, I'll uh, recap later or um, Monday morning when we're packing up. But yeah, stay tuned and enjoy. See us.
How you going everyone? Daniel, uh, recap from Sunday night, five days ago. Uh, yeah, it's been five days at home, kicking about, just um, unloaded. So yeah, we sat in the trailer for a week. Couldn't be bothered. Uh, we had a good night. Ended up, them changes we made for the rear, ended up being a goodie. Um, car's still pretty good, but she's gonna get pulled down for the rest of this season. Zoom out of touch. And, uh, new body sitting over there, ready to go. Yeah, we're gonna, um, maybe go a different direction in engine. Maybe. But, all in all, ended up turning out to be a good night. Sunday, track went my way. Um, was a track that I was sort of looking for, Sadie. We, we had good car speed. We just um, just couldn't get the power to the ground. One of these these Ego Techs, they just um, yeah, to get power to the ground. It, it lights the the rears up like anything. Um, but yeah, uh, Sunday night was better, as you would have seen. Um, now what to do? Don't know. I might have a couple of weeks off. I'll be still floating around. And if you haven't yet, don't forget I put some um, uh, videos and stuff, walking around the pits and stuff um, on our Facebook uh, Stewart's Racing page. Links in the description below. So it just gives you, for all you sort of blokes that are in the US, um, a different sort of look at what the cars we run and stuff like that so i don't know if we'll walk around the pits something a bit different but that's on the facebook page um so head down to that big shout out to all the sponsors for the year because that's us done for the year so victoria rose tea rooms um been a sponsor of mine for years uh they helped me out to get up the swan hill um Gibson signs uh they do all the stickers always look after me um, high port cylinder heads, awesome engine. The engine's up for sale too, as a whole package. Everything except for gearbox and the core packs, they're not. Um, they're not mine. They're borrowed. Um, I just wanted to try the MSD core backs to see if there was any difference. And to be honest, if anyone's going to buy them, just keep your money and go buy some at the wreckers. Uh, I don't didn't find any difference at all. Um, powder performance. Darren down there, uh, he's tuning a lot of race cars, but he's tuning a lot of race cars because he does an awesome job. Um, you know, like uh, if you watch the Victorian title, um, Jackie Boy, uh, proofs in the pudding, he dynoed that car. Um, who comes second? I don't think Reese went to him, but um, just last year, he, just the import and how much he's helped us over the years, it's awesome. Um, GW Racing for the suspension. Uh, look, Bilstein's, I believe, is the go. Um, we went back to Coney's this year just because we couldn't get um, with all the floods that was happening in Australia and shipping stuff off and stuff. So we had to make the decision to put a brand new set of Bilstein, a uh, brand new set of Coney's in it. Um, from Saru's smooth suspension, he does both. So hit him up as well. Um, get on the old Wayne down there. He does an awesome job. But I can tell a diff there's a massive difference between the two. Um, but yeah, Bill's seen all the way. I'll never go back to a Coney ever. Um, he does both. Um, or GW Racing. You know, there's, they're, they're two different people, so they have two different ideas on how it will work. Wayne's could run good with some people, but um, as I said, Wayne's always helped us out. And, you know, if I get a jam, Wayne, you, you know, you'll help, I know you'll help me. Um, so yeah, big thanks for that, for the title and stuff. Um, Darren, another Darren from LV Corn Saw. Old days, what what can I say? For me and Shane and all the family, the help that you put in and, and all that sort of stuff, you, you're a big part and um, even Shane, he, he thanks you a lot. You're a big part of his car for sure. Um, but yeah, Big, big part and friend of the family and the friend of the family, he's part of our family here at Stewart Racing. Um, everyone knows him around the traps. He absolutely helps everyone he can, um, whatever is in his pocket. If he needs to help someone, 
to get him out there he, he will he'll help in every way so big thanks to you darren from lv core and saw um uh trug and exhaust and suspension they do the exhaust on my car uh they have for the last three years it's just um for me polite to put his name on my car we didn't use him this year um we used him the year before but still the same system and that and done a real good job with get my extractors in on a really good deal and stuff like that so yeah everyone involved in us i know shane is going to try and go to alex for their 100 lap a weekend but i'm not that's that's me done i'm not working so no funds in the bank no more race funds and yeah so that's us done for the season plan is to reshell um unless something else happens i'm not too sure what we're gonna do but yeah, big shout out to all the sponsors. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, thanks very much for every, from all the support out there. Um, yeah, that's a wrap from us. You'll see me around and about. Um, I'll continue to do updates on the Facebook page, so keep in there. And like, I'm not getting rid of the YouTube channel. I love the YouTube channel. Um, and yeah, uh, we will obviously show the journey and the progress of what we're doing when we're reshelling but they could start in a week and start in two weeks but unless I win the lottery that's us done for the season so yeah if you like what you see uh, don't forget to hit that like button as much as you can um, subscribe press the bell and love you see you next time